So we're going to start with a check of the weather because places all across our area just saw some snow. Take a look at this video really all across Charlotte, different areas. People were tweeting out their videos that I'm going to show you in a second. We've got video from York, Fort Mill, Uptown, Shelby, Kings Mountain and many more places. The mountains getting a little bit more snow than we did here in Uptown. We've got a live look from downtown Blowing Rock. The snow still falling there and really accumulating on the ground. We have live, live team coverage right at noon to get you all prepared for today, what we're seeing and also ahead for the weekend. So first, let's go to Larry Sprinkle for the latest. Yeah, so the kind of so a lot of people like to see here today, gone today. Yeah, it was quite exciting to see all that snow. First worn Doppler radar uh, in the Charlotte Metro. Area, that's pretty much just rain, but you go west and northwest of here. Still some snow showers out there, anywhere from Boone, Bloin Rock, Banner Oak, all the way along the I-40 corridor, Morganton, Hickory, over towards Shelby, Lincoln, getting some snow showers. A bit heavier snow, as you can see right there, just to the south of Morganton at the moment. This is Rock Hill. Yeah, the snow is ended down there. That's Rock Hill, South Carolina, live view with cloud. And then we look at downtown Boone. Not a lot of snow collecting on the sidewalks or the cars here in downtown Boone, but certainly more is on the way. Future cast, we take it through the afternoon, 1 o'clock, across the Charlotte Metro area. This may be just a cold rain in the mountains, all the way down to areas north of Statesville, Taylorsville. Some snow showers at that time, 3 o'clock this afternoon. Most of the area, it's rain. Some heavier rainfall from Charlotte to Concord, over towards Almar, Lancaster, Chester. That's at 3 o'clock this afternoon. Take it about 4 on your way home today. That commute's going to be a mess. A lot of heavier rainfall east of Interstate 77. Still a few snow showers in the mountains. Then everything starts to track away from here as we get towards the evening. By about 7 o'clock tonight, light rain here. And then by about 11 o'clock tonight, that whole weather system is gone and out of here. Take a look at the temperatures. It's 33 at Bone, 37 at Gastonia, 36 at Charlotte, mid-30s over in Monroe. Temperatures today, not much above the low to mid 40s. So the big question, will we see any more wintry weather? And what about the weekend and maybe some spring like temperatures? We'll check all that coming up in just a few months. Larry, thank you. I want to show you guys some of the video that we're seeing on social media from where everybody saw snow not that long ago. I know if you don't live in the mountains and you don't live up north like me, you get really excited when you start to see some snow. So we're loving your videos. Continue to send them in. Karen, I see your video right here from York. You can see the snow falling and what looks to be her background. Check out this cow here. I don't know if he loves it, hates it, or just is giving the camera a, a stare down, <laughs> loving that from the Tri-County area. And Lake Wiley right here, you can definitely see the snow falling there. People taking videos from over the Catawba, up in Kings Mountain as well. So it was definitely an exciting thing to see. We all saw it right here coming down at the uh, station right off of Billy Graham Parkway. So send us your videos so we continue to see what happens in your neck of the woods. But right now our team weather coverage continues with meteorologists. Chris Mulcahy joining me live from the Chevy Storm Tracker. Where are you at and what are you seeing? Well, Rachel, you actually just said it. We're right around Kings Mountain and right ahead of us, all rain right now. Temperatures right around 35 degrees. We decided to go to Cleveland County because Shelby right now is at 32. So we're right along what is called the rain snow line. And the reason why the Charlotte area saw that snow, if you looked in the radar, most likely you just saw greens or those darker greens. Sometimes there could be a pocket of cold air just above. So when that snow was hitting the ground, it was actually more of a slushy snow, still mixing with some of that rain, but it was a beautiful sight to see but the day in general not so beautiful this is pretty much what you can expect most of the afternoon light to moderate rain continuing through the afternoon we're going to continue to head off towards the west and northwest through the day today because that's where the possibility of snow is going to be but all of us are going to have that cold cold rain even though we're just barely getting to that 40 degree point it's not going to be feeling great so we'll continue to keep you updated on our later newscasts at four five and six in the meantime i'm meteorologist chris mulkey reporting from the chevy storm tracker